In, back in February, the FDA announced a recall on powdered baby formula that included several popular brands. Here in Lincoln, mothers are feeling the effects, now facing a shortage on the store shelves. Channel 8's Danielle Kaiser shows us more. For the first time since the pandemic began, stores are facing a shortage of infant powdered formula. In addition to a recall, production during COVID slowed way down. Across Nebraska, parents are struggling to find their child's formula. Grocery stores have even begun rationing how much a household can buy. One Lincoln mother, Nalani Lattenhoff, says she's had to quickly wean her child off of formula since the shortage. It's been really hard with formula. We can't find formula anywhere, at least for my baby specifically. She needed um, the lactose sensitive formula and it's just been out everywhere we've been. So we just had to hurry up and wean her off of it. Other moms like Sammy Olson of Omaha don't have that choice with newborns like her nine week old daughter, Lillian. So my daughter was actually born right as the shortage was happening. And when I first found out, I was like, okay, well, if I have to supplement, I'll take, take whatever's available and then breastfeed. But unfortunately I was unable to breastfeed. Um, so I like rely almost 100% on formula. It is suggested by CHI Health's medical director, Michael Schaff, to abide by your infant's needs and not use any alternate formulas to supplement them. You don't want to try to make your own formula. Um, all, you don't want to water down the formula to make it last longer. All of those things can really mess with babies. I do recommend either breast milk or formula for all infants up to one year of age. Then, then after one year of age, they can transition into whole milk. Um, and then after two years of age to whatever milk product the family likes to drink. According to retail software company Data Assembly, approximately 31% of infant formulas are out of stock nationwide. There's no sign of when they will make a return to shelves. Reporting in Lincoln, Daniel Kaiser, Channel 8 News. And if you have any questions or concerns, uh, obviously be sure to check with your doctor or your child's pediatrician.